all I, all I wanted was a hundred million dollars and a bad chick. Imagine this a muscle nice and felt like that I had it. Back on the mattress, staring at the ceiling. What is good, everybody? What's popping, y'all? So today's video is going to be on a whole video on how I met Chris and Queen. Um, I should have done this a while back ago, but uh, I didn't. So I want to address it now, just in case you know, because a lot of people ask me, like family members, like everybody, how did you make meet Chris and Queen? Well. Let me explain in this video so you don't have to ask again. So guys, uh, this whole video is going to be on Chris and Queen. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And most important, if you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe. But guys, follow me on my social media real quick. Underscore Massey19 is my Instagram. Joshua Massey111. Three ones is my Snapchat. But without further ado, Let's get into this video. So, how I met Chris and Queen. Okay, so a little background. So, you all know I, you know I know Vante and Damien. So we did this, uh, we did this little reality show that you guys know about. It was in Atlanta. So uh, basically, I found out that I was going to be in a house with a whole bunch of YouTubers. Um, and one of them being Chris and Queen, you know, so, uh, yeah, I did that and, uh, you know, the reality show was a success. It was real cool. I met a whole bunch of, uh, YouTubers that I've, you know, never met before in my life. So that was actually, you know, a great experience. So yeah, uh, how I met them, you know, we did that reality show and, I was just, you know, hanging out, chilling in this house. It was like a, some log cabin house, and it was like a, you know, a big mansion. But um, yeah, uh, I met them. It was, it all started in this living room. Like I was just chilling, and then uh, Chris is like, "Who wanna, who wanna play 2K?" And uh, you know, someone said, "Yeah." I think Bonte said, "You know, I'll play." I was like, oh, cool. You know, I'm going to just watch. And, you know, we just started talking. Everybody started talking. And, you know, we just started doing our thing. And everybody just started bonding and stuff. And, uh, you know, uh, you know, me and Chris weren't, like, you know, friends right off the bat. But, you know, like, we started talking, you know, everything. Everything was cool. We played basketball. You know, that I think it was, like, a whole week that we stayed in the house together. So, you know, we got, you, we got acquainted pretty good. And, you know, uh... I think we just clicked like that, like, real quick. So, like, after the reality show, we all split back. And so, Chris and Queen lived in Houston. And um, we were just like, okay, um, they live in Houston. So, you know, me and Vante ended up going down there. So, me and Vante went down there one time because Chris told us, Chris was like, hey, yeah, you know, come out. Come out uh, in Houston, and, you know, I'll show you around and, you know, we can hang out and stuff. So we did, and we hung out, and he was like, come down. So we drove down here, drove down there. I, I think we drove down or flew down. I think we flew down this time. And the second time when we ended up, you know, going down there for a little bit, we ended up uh, driving. I drove down there like 17 hours. That's besides the point. But we flew down there, and, you know, we started hanging out, and, like, I don't know, I just felt like, you know how you meet that one friend or, you know, whoever, how many, however many friends, and you just like, you just click like that and you just like, like, dang, like, I feel like I've known this dude for like 10, 50,000 years, like 15 years. And so that's how I felt. Like, I felt like I'd known this dude for forever. And uh, yeah, everything just like clicked so quick with Chris for one, you know, I'll get to Queen in a second. But uh, everything clicked, you know, so quick with him, and we were just laughing, we were telling jokes, and, you know, everything was just normal, like, cool. And it was just like, dang, like, we clicked, we clicked that easy, like, boom, like, that quick? Like, that was ridiculous. So, um, that's how, that's how I, you know, I met Chris, and then Queen, of course, uh, that's how I met Chris and Queen, but Queen, like, you know, Queen's a character for one. Queen's a hilarious person. Um, you know, both of them are. But uh, Queen, yeah, she, like, 
how I met her was the same way. Um, not playing 2K, but uh, we were in the same house together. Uh, I forget what she. I think she was talking about her music one time when we were in the like this little living room place that was in like the little log cabin house. It was I don't even know what to call it. It was, it was like it was weird. It was a weird house. But you know, I just saw her. You know, we talked about. She started talking about her music. We all talked about like where we came from and all that. And you know, it was just. You know, Queen's a freaking cool, amazing, talented girl, and uh, we we ended up uh, talking a little bit, you know, and got acquainted, and you know, we've been friends ever since. Um, yeah, I mean, that's how I really met Chris and Queen. Like, we just, you know, and then we, uh, so we ended up moving down there, and uh, that junk was one of the best experiences of my life. I uh, met a lot of cool people. Uh, if you guys want me, before I keep going, like, okay, I'll keep going. But, so, me and Chris and Queen, you know, that's how we met. And then we moved down, we ended up moving down there, you know, staying down there for, like, four, four or five months. Like, a good amount of time, like, dang near half a, half a year. I mean, it's six months, but dang near half a year. And we just, you know, we stayed down there with them for a while, I, you know, I did... And I just, you know, I just felt like a quick, like that was my brother and sister. Like I would do anything for him, you know, all that. Like that's how quick, like we did that. Like had some freaking phenomenal times, great times. Like I can't, I can't wait till, you know, I can go back. But uh, like I go back, which I don't know when I will. But, you know, like we did a whole bunch of stuff together. And, you know, just like basically how we met too is uh we um we went to houston again and we met up with chris and queen armand and trey and perfect laughs and uh, i think a couple other people and you know we just started hanging out you know armand and trey and freaking those my brothers bro like the, i love them to death they always let me just you know say this like they came out with some heat like this uh the, the mashup that they just did uh Freaking Kelly Clarkson, I think Medicine. That stuff was fire. Like I can't keep, I keep playing that junk nonstop. Boom, boom, boom. Keep going. But uh, yeah, like, and I met Armand and Trey through Chris and Queen because they came over to the house one time, and uh, you know, me and Armand clicked like that. Like we just started playing basketball, and that's just how how it went. We started talking and everything, and you know, as as you hang out with a person every single day, like you get really close. And then Trey, I mean, he didn't play basketball, but like, you know, that's a cool dude. Like, <laughs> that's a real cool, chill dude. And we just, you know, we just started clicking and talking and, you know, telling jokes. And how you get close with somebody, you just, you know, you just keep telling them experiences like through your life or hanging out with them every single day, you just getting to know each other. And that's what we did, you know, just kept doing that every day. And, you know, we are where we are now. And, uh,. <sighs> But uh, Perfect Laughs, um, that is a freaking crazy, cool, amazing, chill, chill person. Like, that is a definition of just like a, like a, the person you just want to chill. Like, like everybody's like, oh, I'm trying, who's trying to chill? Perfect Laughs. Like, that girl is, <laughs> that's the homie, for real, for real. But uh, how we met is uh, the same way, you know. She came over to, or she came down to Houston one time, and I was there, and uh, we just started hanging out and doing what we do, and uh, it, we just clicked, and now we are where we are, and we're super close and everything. But uh, yeah, that's really how I, that's how I met Kristen Queen. I mean, that's how I met Armand and Trey and Perfect Laughs too. Like pretty much, I met Armand and Trey and Perfect Laughs through Kristen Queen. But how I met Kristen Queen was just you know through a reality TV show. And just started talking every day. He started clicking. He invited us out to Houston one time. And then, you know, just got closer. And then we went back to Fort Wayne. And then uh, ended up make, making a decision and uh, moving down to Houston. And we stayed with them for a while. And we just got to clicking. And that, that easy. That's what happens when you talk to people and do stuff like that and interact. So, uh, yeah, that is basically the video on how I met... Chris and Queen. So basically, I met Chris and Queen through a reality TV show, um, and that you know, and started talking. So uh, that's how I met Chris and Queen. 
love Chris and Queen to death. <laughs> but uh, yeah, guys, that's the end of this video. Um, hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys never knew how me, Chris and Queen, how me and Chris and Queen uh, met, that's how that's how we met. So uh, and that's how I met Armand and Trey and Perfect Laughs as well. And um, yeah, if you guys want me to make a a um, video on how me it, how me and M and Bond met. Let me know, because I will. But, um, hope you guys enjoy this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And, um, I'm coming out with an outro soon. So, uh, that will be going on the end of this video, obviously, because it's an outro. But, um, hope you guys enjoy this video. Love you guys so much. Thanks for supporting me. Peace out. <laughs>